already told me you've got some big confirms already there. Uh, yeah, you got Anti, DeBuzz, Mr. E. That's all That's all you need. Let's go. Let's open this next match, man. We got we got Mr. Bankai fighting off against King Ark. Yeah. Now, King Ark actually won a Xeno uh, a bit ago. Yeah, man. But number 15 on the PR, man. Uh, King Ark's the real deal. Hey, that's crazy that we have a number 15 win a Xeno. Yeah, I mean, that's nuts. I think it just goes to show you, you know, the strength of our region. Mm. And Bankai, another guy, is uh, no not even PR. He beat 6W. No, no, no. Who did he beat at that tournament? Uh, uh, he 3 0 ZD. He 3 0 ZD. Yeah. yeah, he 3 0 ZD, man. That's my like, joint. Yeah, he did that at um that Jersey tournament. The Rutgers, the Rutgers class. Oh, the Rutgers. coming to Tri State to uh, give it another shot. Let's uh -huh. do Better luck next time. <laughs> yeah. Um, but right now, uh, King Ark is um, shots fired. Good. Jesus Christ! Off to a fast start. Well, oh wow! I I, I actually respect that option. You know, you go off super deep with Ivy Sword with that neutral air covers all. You know, the recovery yeah. pretty Ooh. well. And King Ark, you know, going low because Ivy Sword is usually mm. Vine Whip low. So. Yeah, Bankai, you just recently went to a uh, CSL this previous weekend. Got, I believe, a fifth. I want to say. Okay. Yeah. Uh, but it was the best New Yorker placed out there, you know, out of two. Um, but, oh! <gasps> Yo, if you got that, that down to it? That'd been sick. And now, you know, whenever Bunkai goes for Charizard, he's always going to be hungry for that grab. It seems to be, it's, I, I feel like it's his favorite kill option. Ooh. And, um, King are going for that falling up at the ledge because at this percent, you, uh, you're, you will die. You won't mm. get the sparks, but the wind will carry you upwards and you'll die at this percent. Oh, yeah, this is going to be super scary. You know what? Just catch the back air shield, catching you, jumping into the air. Now, Squirtle's coming out to say hello. Yeah, common option we were talking about earlier. A lot of people like to jump out of shield in this game because mm. um, one of the generally safer options since everybody has a frame free jump squad. Right. So, King Art getting on to that um, habit. And withdraw, you got to be super careful. With. I like how Bankai literally threw out Withdraw and immediately switched characters so he didn't get like predictable with it. Oh, yeah. Um, withdraw can leave you vulnerable if you get footstooled, obviously. Oh. I like that confirm. Oh, yeah. Razor Leaf, one of Ivysaur's like strongest confirms out there, honestly. But it's unsafe to go for if you do it point blank. Oh yeah. So you know Bankai's facing that accordingly, so good stuff. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and okay, so he's trying to get these um Schmixies. Down air loops with the uh, Spur. You know, I got King Arc over here trying to get these anti airs. I, I like that Bankai goes for the double jump that high in the air, because there's really not much as King Arc could have gone for to try to counteract that before committing to his up B. Yeah, and just like I was saying earlier, man, he did that withdraw, put himself to the end of the stage, and King Ark immediately took advantage. Yeah. I feel like you can get away with that move, like, once, and then, you know, if the player's strong, like King Ark, he'll catch that. Yeah, yeah. Can't be spamming that nonsense. Still a close game. Okay, we got the back airs. We go, got the Ooh. parry coming out from the metal blade. Nice triple parry. Oh. I like that call out. The up air out of the ledge, trying to send him up flying. Yeah, and that falling up air is so dangerous because it's one of those moves where like it can confirm into itself and just outright kill you. <laughs> so it is a uh, King Ark is just kind of spamming moves at this point, just throwing them out. You saw that edge guard potential right there. He was just trying to cover so many different options, and Bankai just kind of lazily got back onto the stage. Connects yeah. the back after the ledge dropping off the platform. He pretty much got the la the last hit of back. I don't even think that was the strong hit. I think I just think King Ark expected to get hit by it. I think he's just a big boy, dude. Charizard can hit like a truck. Yeah, and, and he's sticking with him because he wants to he wants to keep the weight because he's at high percent. Yeah, and um, Charizard um, is actually really good at uh, ledge trapping in this game. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, he always has had had a strong ledge trapping game. But I think it's one of the underrated things about Charizard. People always used to write it off Charizard, but like that nair. Wow. That, that, okay, I thought that was gonna kill. Okay, it so, did. So, like, that character has really big hitboxes at the legend. Like you just saw, he has that nair and that backer that pretty much went, like, halfway I'm up sorry, the what percent was he at when we saw those sparks? Uh, 50. 100%. Oh, yes, 50.4%. Yes. Beautiful. And, he, and when he came back, it's at 70%. It's just like... The downer did 17%. I, I, the backer did Listen, man, Charizard's a big boy. He eats his Wheaties. He's also at maximum rage. Eats, at the edge of the stage of Smashville. Like, he apparently eats robots and children also. Like, yeah. Like Might as well... I mean, if that was WarioWare, dog, like, he, he'd be... Yo, WarioWare? He would have exploded. Hey, man, look. We need WarioWare for the culture, okay? I need WarioWare for that disgusting background. Like that looks like it was made like by Ed and Nettie or something. Yeah, like, don't talk about Ed and Nettie like that. Ed and Nettie I love Ed and Nettie, dog. Don't get, don't get canceled on stream. I no, I love Ed and Nettie. It's one of my favorite shows growing up. Mm -hmm. It is. Okay. Who's your favorite character? Um, 
If you say plank, plank. if you say plank, so help me God. Scammer Eddie. Okay, let's ult is sick. Yeah, Thank you, is awesome. It is. I love ult. Ultimate. Let's go. Yeah, so we're gonna go into Yoshi Star. Why do you think you picked Yoshi Star? Uh honestly, just for a change of pace, I guess, because I feel like maybe you wanted to go to Battlefield. Because Mega Man thrives off the triplats, right? And Battlefield might have gotten banned, so we opted to go for Yoshi Story instead. Also has the walls down below, which Mega Man thrives off of. It allows him to put the crash bombs onto the walls. Yeah, and also if you get smack, you know, you could um, tech off that off the ledge of mm. the wall. Excuse me. Right. Um, yeah, and I know King Ark especially loves this stage. He goes to the stage almost kind of stage almost all the time. Yeah. He's That's a huge fan of it. Yeah. Even when he, he even when he does that battlefield build one, that was a crazy recovery. Yeah, I mean, thankfully using every single one of his resources, including the directional air dodge. Yeah, but right now, Bankai's had him in disadvantage for pretty much a good yeah. solid 50 seconds. This is the first time we've seen King Ark with stage control. Yeah. There we go. Tosses him off. Wait, hold on a second. He just jumps. Yeah. And the okay. Yeah, now the patient's coming from King Ark because his ledge trapping is probably one of the strongest ledge trappers like, yeah. in this region. I mean, he landed the forward smash, but that was just not worth the trick. And Whatever, Bonka. I mean, if you want to throw away stocks, dude, just... Men the children these days, man. You I have don't know. Yeah. <laughs> wait, wait, is he... Wait, wait. Is he with the... Sh what? Shut up. What is happening? Did, did he just, like, blue screen? Um. What? <laughs> Bonka? Okay, Chad, I need you to not swat us or call the cops. <laughs> what? what? <laughs> because I don't know what the hell's going on. That was crazy. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what is happening? What is going on? <laughs> Yo, somebody close the door. His pocket can definitely hear us. Oh, what? my God. Okay, okay. So... Um, I, I want to rewatch what happened. I, did it? I want. Did he get foot? Did he go for withdraw and then get like footstool? I actually didn't see. I just saw. Oh no! He, tried he uses air. He uses his neutral yeah. air dodge. He no, was trying yeah, to like shield or air, uh, roll on the ledge or something. Yeah, he tried directional air dodge yeah. immediately. And you know what it was? I feel like he thought that he would. He have also got spiked at the, at the last end too. Oh my god! So I uh, say so, okay. So here's what happens, right? So the thing about leaf shield is um, it sucks to get hit by it, right? You get hit by right. leaf, leaf shield. It, it sucks to get hit by it in the first place. And now you're in disadvantage, right? So now he tried to immediately get out of Leaf Shield and try to air dodge back onto the stage. Missed the stage completely and didn't even expect it. So he wasn't even mashing anything. So it's kind of just like in the end lag of directional air dodge and you saw. Okay. So, I mean, it happens. You know what, Bars? Here's my theory. He, he didn't want to play he, that game. See, and he almost just did it again. He almost died. <laughs> yeah, you know, he, but this time he did neutral air dodge. So it was end lag. He almost did it again. My theory is that he did it on purpose so he didn't have to play on his, his opponent's counter pick and keep the momentum. Yeah, it's next level. You're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I believe Bonko. Um, okay. But right now, King Ark carrying that momentum um, into Smashville. Honestly, I feel like Bonka is mentally drained right now after that. Like that. Like I. What would you be? What, was, what would be going through oh your my mind? God. Spot dodge up to. What would be going through your mind if that happened to you? Yeah, I mean, you're down a stock already in the final game. Yeah, because you know what it was. Bonka was in complete control of that match until those two SDs happened. Literally, yeah, he had the advantage like, for so long. Like he, like I'm talking, he was in complete control. And now on um, the tides have turned, like, Bankai is just out of it. But let's see what we can do. Because remember, he did keep King Ark in disadvantage yeah. for, like, a whole minute in game two. And it's nowhere near over. There's three stocks for a reason. Yeah. So, um, see, and the reason King Ark is throwing that leaf shield every time he, when uh, Bankai shields it is because it's unsafe on him. So if he shields it and he just throws it out in front of Bankai's shield, he gets a hard punish. Yeah, you're going to have to be able to respect that. I mean, he's playing pretty solidly right now. Yeah. Trying yeah. to stay calm, King Ark struggling to get back onto the stage. Looking a lot like the beginning of that previous yeah. game. Yeah, Bankai has a very strong ledge game. So, him doing this is no surprise. See, yeah. and that's the, what he just did right there is what he was trying to do before. Mm. Um, he tried to immediately air dodge out of it, but he messed up at the ledge. So, um, actually working out for him this time. I have sort of one of those few characters that actually gives you like a free re-grab, as long as you have your up, you know, use Vine Whip. Yeah, depending on the character. Yeah, depending on the character and depending on where they're at, you know? Yeah, but for the most part, it's like pretty safe option. Yeah. Okay, you see him trying to bait out options, you know, falling down, going for the double jump. Yeah, and you know what? And I kind of like what Bankai's doing right now because he's just taking his time. Like he, like, he knows he's down. He knows he needs to catch his bearings. And there's no need to rush and go rushing in because the first thing people try to do when they're down is throw out a whole bunch of random attacks. Mm -hmm. And he knows he doesn't need to do that right now. But King Ark right. is still in, like, firm control. The King Ark is playing incredibly solidly right now. Looking for that down air. Bankai's going to be able to avoid that. Catches the anti arrow with an up smash. Yeah. Immediately neutral get up just to get out of that situation. Now, this is Bankai's time to just start racking up some damage against King Ark. Or King Ark can do All King Ark needs is a grab. Tosses him off stage. 
Yeah. You know, let's see what Bonga can do with the stock. Whoa! Oh! Oh, that confirmed? I've, I've actually never seen that before. That was sick! <laughs> Up air to forward air, that works? I have 100% never seen that before. That was, wow! That was, that was, let's that go, King Ark. That, that was, was sick! That was wild. Um, right now, Bonkai are right back on the hunt. Um, attacking on a couple percent as he respawns. Let's see, you know, let's see if Bonkai gets something started. Because. Uh, yeah, honestly, he's kinda, look, it's looking like a wrap. Oh, hold on. Yeah, no. He's got, he's, got his, he's got control. Yeah, and that's... Oh, he misses dash dark, but that's mm. a free punish, man. That's very unsafe on shield. Oh, oh. That's, oh yeah, that's a panic up here. He just didn't want to be down there. Mm. He didn't want to be back on the ledge. He just took the F smash. Okay, ooh, okay. you know, Banka, you know, right now, he has Kegrick at 95%, yeah. so... Ooh, okay. Oh, that's the first time King Rush recovered like that, too. You saw Bankai was expecting the recovery. He usually does. Up Ooh. air, double, has to go for the air dodge, yeah. don't double jump in the middle of that. Yeah, and, and King Ark reading that, um... <gasps> okay. Didn't read that. Honestly, like... He, he, with Charizard, like, he's getting all of his kills with Charizard. This might be the, the boy to go Ooh, to. okay, and he switched, ooh, he switched back to Squirtle. Uh, and he's off stage. Um, might yeah. want to swap. Oh no, was too busy swinging, gets caught by the forward smash. His, his focus was on the crash bomb. Didn't see the forward smash coming. You know, uh, you know, to be honest, it probably would have been in his best interest to stay Charizard. Because um, Bankai's Charizard is pretty good. It's not like his Charizard's bad. Yeah. And, you know, Charizard, like I said before, like, Bankai's ledge game is really good. Yeah. And I think um, he could have made it work for Charizard. But, you know, decided to go for Squirtle. You know, still a good matchup. But, you know, just got caught slipping. I mean, kind of unfortunate, you know, that with the SDs and stuff like that. But, like, you know.